I think I said something flippantly online, like, oh, I might as well be drawing every pub in London, and then, because I was drawing so many pubs, and then I sort of looked into it and thought, well, maybe I should just have a go. <laughs> kind of um, without realising how many pubs there were. I knew there'd be a lot, I'm not sure I kind of calculated how long it would take me, but yeah, 3,500 pubs. It sort of was a, a project or a fixation <laughs> that started through lockdown. So I kind of put the word out and said, you know, I'm opening up my commissions. I know a lot of people haven't lost their job. Maybe people would still like to buy some artwork. And it kind of went a little bit crazy. And I, I realized I mostly got commissions of pubs. And I think at the time that was, it kind of made sense um, because pubs were closed. I was honestly directed by sort of my like <laughs> my missing the pub basically um, that's where I socialize and so obviously not only losing my job losing my social life and not seeing my friends had become quite apparent I decided to tell people about it in a very sort of uh, tongue-in-cheek way like quite a humorous way um, kind of you know I am I crazy for doing this uh, there's so many, this is going to take me 10 plus years, like kind of silly short joke, jokey videos which are very popular on TikTok. How many of those did you take? I took nine. I took nine, yeah. I, uh, I did, I think, slightly overcommit. And then the, the response to it was like overwhelmingly positive and it was please draw this pub, please draw this pub, please draw this pub. And I've just used that as a jumping off point since to let it direct me to actually which pubs I'm going to draw. Pencils that you're using? I like using F, which is pretty hard. It's an F? Yeah. Oh, really? I like to use quite a hard pencil. They feel so quintessentially British that whether you're a pub person or not, I think, yeah, they're just like, I don't know, they're great buildings to look at or be in. And I think that kind of emotion, emotional attachment to them is why people want a picture of their pub at home. So far, every pub I've drawn in situ, I've had like really great reactions, which you just can't get at home <laughs> on your own. So um, yeah, I think, I think my preference is to draw in front of the pub. But if I was to draw all 3,500 pubs in front of the pub, I think it would probably add on another few years to the project. So having a kind of mixture of doing some at home um, and some in front of the pub at the moment is working. I think it just took less than three hours, two and a half hours. Um, it's funny, there's so many people around, but actually it felt like quite a peaceful drawing. Someone commented on one of my videos uh, Basically, they said that their grandfather was Norman, and this is, was originally called Norman's Coach and Horses, and I think he was the landlord. I honestly think if I was to stay at the same rate I'm going and have to sort of juggle work and things like that, I think it could probably take me about 40 to 50 years. <laughs>